it's part and parcel of football, I suppose. I mean, I knew I was a little bit sore before the Celtic game, whatever, but I knew it was an important game for myself and for the club. And obviously, to score that goal makes it, as I said at the time, it was worth it to have a moment like that. But I was disappointed to miss the week after, but I was lucky enough to be fit again for the Dundee game, so hopefully, I just got back into the stride. I think it's it's clear to see when you look at a league table from when he took over to what the league table is like now. It's just it's been an unbelievable year for everybody involved at the club, from the supporters all the way through the playing staff. And I personally look at it from my point of view of when I was first up here on loan that year. I didn't really know where my career was heading at that point. I wasn't thriving at Newcastle we were home and then we hadn't got off to the best start here but for the turnaround the club's had it's also had a major effect on how it's helped me as well and I just I feel lucky to be part of something that's going so well at the moment. It's one of the ones like it's everybody's dream obviously to play international football but I'm very well aware that there's a lot of good players and I'm very well aware that I might be playing quite well but it's there's boys that have been doing it for years and yeah, I'd like to get it in the future, obviously everybody would, but at this moment in time, I'll be honest, there's more important to make sure that I'm doing well for Kilmarnock and doing well for the manager because he's the one that's put the faith in me, giving me a deal here and things, and it's just, obviously everybody wants the international side, but I'm more interested in just making sure I do what I do for Kelly and making sure that I'm doing what the manager asks of me. No, not at all. Like We are full aware that we're doing well this season, but at no point do we definitely don't underestimate any team like we'd go into a game against anybody in the league knowing that if we don't play our best we're not confident of getting a result because we know we have to be on it every game to keep up the performance that we have and it's not even a matter of keeping up performance to win games it's to keep up performance to the high standard of the manager he expects the best of us and he would be the first one to never let a bit of complacency and I don't even think complacency would come into it because Smyrna are a good side we played them in the Betfred Cup at the start of the season and they showed that we're a very good side that night. We are probably, maybe not our best, but we've got enough in each out of the game. But we know that if we want to get the result, we need to go there and nearly perform. 100%. I mean, I think if you ask any football player in the world, that there's nothing better when I mean, you've got the, the backing of the fans at home and away games. But last week, when, well, not last week, two weeks ago, when we were at Dundee, the travelling support were absolutely amazing. And from what I've heard, I think we've sold a really good allocation for the... It's a run game as well, so I'm looking forward to hopefully putting on a performance and sending the fans home happy.